Hello knitters, Barbara Benson here. I am an independent knitwear designer who also likes to make knittertaining videos here on my YouTube channel, Watch Barbara Knit. I have a short little video for you today because I just wanted to put it out there. I just wanna make it clear that I am going to New York Sheep and Wool this weekend. Woohoo! Rhinebeck is what is commonly called Rhinebeck. Rhinebeck is actually the location. It's Rhinebeck, New York. It's in the upstate area, but it is the New York Sheep and Wool Festival, which is completely bonkers. It is amazing. It is a huge state fairgrounds kind of location. It's very hilly. It's got gorgeous foliage um, and a truly ludicrous number of knitters and spinners and weavers and crocheters and textile artisans of all every shape size everything it is it is an amazing it's like disney world <laughs> for knitters and textile artists and everything because it's a sheep and wool festival they actually have sheeps and wool there and alpaca and llamas um i'll link to a couple of videos that i've made in my previous years of going it is just mind boggling and really almost impossible to explain everything that is there. But the reason why I make this video is because I will be there and I will be signing my new book, Big Yarn Beautiful Lace Knits. Again, links in the description below if you want to know more about my book. It pretty much is all lace patterns knit in bulky yarn and that way it goes super fast i will be signing in building b that is up on the hill um in one of like the the actual not the barns so there's areas that are they're called barns and they're more um like when there's more livestock there, it's where all the livestock is, but there's livestock in some of them, but then all kinds of awesome stuff you can buy in all of the other ones. And that's one big section. And then up on the hill, there's like a more permanent uh, enclosed type in structure. And those are, I'm going to be in building B, which is the middle one. And it's in the back. It's where it's called author's row. And it's where all the book signings go on. There are going to be a bunch of absolutely amazing authors of all kinds of textile arts. They're signing for Merit Bookstore. Merit Book and Toy Store is a local to the Rhinebeck area store that brings in the authors and so you're actually if you go there you're buying the book from this local store and then they have all of us back there that you can get us to sign the book and we can say hi and everything and occasionally hug i have been known to hug um so i have my specifics i am doing a they call it um I can't remember what it's called. It's like a yarn talk or something like that. And I will be giving on Saturday, I will be giving a talk at 10 o'clock and then I'm be signing books from 11 to 12. I'm going to sneak out for lunch, which they have amazing lunch. The Flawful is so good. And then there's apple dumplings and people go crazy over the artichoke French, which I haven't stood in the line to get yet, but apparently they take a whole artichoke and like cut it up and deep fry it like a blooming onion. Mm, crazy. I also got one of those tater twister things once where it's a tater, uh, a tato, a tater, a potato, potato that has been like spiral cut and put on a stick and it's like an according and it's like boingy boingy and they deep fry it and that's delicious. Um, so wow, I got sidetracked on food <laughs> and then I'll be signing from one to four thirty. Uh, that's on Saturday and then on Sunday I'm going to be signing from 10 to 2 and hopefully I'll talk someone to bringing me some food but I will be there and I will be signing books and I very much hope to possibly meet some of y'all come say hi if you watch the YouTube channel please let me know and I'll be so excited I can't stand it and since Sunday is 10 to 2 uh, I'm gonna have to look and see usually there's like a meetup on the hill 
If you all want to talk to me in the comments, we might be able to work out something to, to get together. Just let me know. But I'm so excited. I'm flying out on Thursday. Got to get everything set up on Friday. And then Saturday and Sunday is going to be Yarny Party time. Yarny Party, Yarny Party. I have one thing. I am so proud of myself that I remembered to do something very important. I'm gonna do a quick, it's not really an unboxing. I know what it is, but, so you stick this in here, because these are the kind of things that I frequently forget to do. <laughs> Don't need that. <laughs> this is our, my business cards. <laughs> I get them from Moo and they're super duper cute, I think. And so now I have them. I had some, a few left over from TNNA, but I didn't want to run out. So I have my business cards. I'm going to take this extra yellow stuff off. I don't need that either. But if you come to get my, just say, I mean, I'd love to sign a book if you get one, but if you just want to come say hi, I can probably give you one of my business cards and maybe sign it. I don't know. There's not enough for space really, but I would love to see any of y'all who are coming. So let me know in the description below or just show up and say hi. Again, it's a really short video. It's not on a normal video day, but I wanted to say, come and see me. So. And for all y'all who are going to Rhinebeck, I'm sorry to be so excited, but um, you will be there with us in spirit <laughs> because I think that it's like all Yarny people are there in spirit. And hopefully I'll be traveling more um, if you actually have a local knitting girl guild or a local yarn store who likes to bring people in, send them my way and I might be able to come to your area. So just let me know. If you like this video, please give it the thumbs up or if you're excited about Rhinebeck, click that like button. And if you'd like to know whenever I upload a new video, please subscribe to my channel and select notifications. Thank you so much.